up, Jones Bones? It is your girl, Unitedly Random. I know, I know, the hair is growing out. I don't know how long I'm gonna let it grow out, but it's growing out for now. Today was my first day pretty much off in a long while. And I mean like off, like I took a holiday. I took a holiday off. Today is June the 6th. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. June the 5th. Today is June the 5th. There's babies crying in the background. And that baby kind of loud. <laughs> Okay, and I am back and I have been editing videos today and I've really been just focusing on being distracted. I'm trying to stay positive, trying to keep moving, but like, to be honest with you, I didn't know if I was gonna talk about this on my channel or not. And by the time I post this, it's gonna be like way in the future. The death of my brother really mess with me, okay? Because it brought my family to the forefront of my mind. And I was doing good without thinking about them, to be honest. I was doing so well, just kind of separating myself from that mentally. But now, the death of my brother has me like uh, using my VPN to go online, look, look on Instagram, look on Facebook, just to kind of get an idea of like what's happening or like get some type of like knowledge or just, I don't know, I don't know, just be there in some type of way because you know, I'm all the way overseas. And that's the thing, like being overseas really puts a damper on this, this idea of family. It really isolates you from your family. You know, on my end, though, I did, you know, isolate myself from my family before I even went overseas. For those who don't know, I pretty much went, well, I, I pretty much lived up to the, the one child that, like, walks away and probably will never come back in my family. Um, and it's been fine, you know? <laughs> Every once in a while, I mean, like, once... Probably like, it's, I think with my little sister, it's probably gonna be like twice a year. She'll reach out to me. <laughs> and um, I don't, I'm not doing the reaching out anymore. I'm just kind of just staying in my own little bubble just to preserve me and try to get to a better space. Um, and I have been getting to a better space, honestly, like just walking away from that gave me so many opportunities to heal myself. But like I said, the death of my brother kind of brought me back to thinking about family and that being the forefront of my ideas. I'm a very open person for those who don't know. Hello, my name is Unitedly Random on my channel. I talk about mental health, body image, childhood things. I randomly talk about random things. That is why we're called Unitedly Random. Um, and so the random thing that I'm talking about today is the fact that, yeah, I feel like I've already said it a couple of times, but yeah, I've been thinking about my family and I hate it, okay? I've been thinking so much about my family and like, like, it's like, I've said it before, but when you mourn the death of a family member, you're like mourning the death of a family member, right? But then when you're like the exchange, 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 ex when you're the family member that walked away from the family, you're, you're already in mourning of the family. But then when someone dies, it's like double mourning. So like, it's like there's, and then there's this, I wouldn't say guilt, but there's this creeping guilt. Does that make sense? This creeping guilt of, do you even deserve to feel sad because you walked away from the family? It's a very complex feeling. And again, I said, like, by the time this comes out, the situation would have already passed. But that's what was going on in my head. And on top of that, there's this idea of, like, who do you talk to about this? Like, you know? So I thought I'd just go ahead and take that to my channel. Because, like always, my channel is a place for my... Um, thoughts not to die, but just to have some type of resting point. Um, just, I heard that noise and I was like, that, that baby crying, crying. I just wanna, somebody, 
Put that baby in my arms. Let me just rock the baby. Oh, the little baby. Oh, the little baby. Ah. Poor little baby. You know, um, but uh, I've been sitting here. I edited three videos. I'm really proud of myself for editing three videos. Like, it's not like this big, crazy thing. Especially the videos that I've been doing lately. They're not like sit down, like edit, put some music, da 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 da, -da. Let me change it. No, I, I put a lot more work into my videos back before I got to this point. And now I, I'm just kind of showing up, um, showing my face on the, like, the, on the camera. And I enjoy that too, so... I don't really know exactly where this channel is going to go, but I think it's always going to be me just talking to you. Like, hey, girl, how you doing, girl? And it's not even me talking to you. It's me talking to me because <laughs> I'm a Leo and you know how it is. I'm a Leo. I got ADHD. I come back and I look at myself and I'm like, wow, there's videos that I watched from like way, way, way back then. Way, 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 way in the past where I'm like, wow you was really feeling that way you was really feeling that emotion and i see myself sometimes and i'm like wow you're taking care of yourself and this thing you're like you can tell you can really tell so this is like just a video diary of me like i freaking love youtube i think even if i wasn't making money from youtube i'm not even really making money from youtube but even if i wasn't making money from youtube like i am now I would still be posting and like the people that I've met like I mostly met more people through TikTok but the people that I have met through the internet you know they became my family when I was walking away from my family and now like I'm all the way overseas you know and I, I don't have that direct uh closeness with my online family because the place that I am is you know kind of you know like it's kind of like Oh, you want to use the internet? <laughs> so, it is what it is, but I don't know what the future will bring, and I'm going to stop trying to pretend like I do. I'll let you know what I know, but I don't know nothing. So, until next time, this is seven minutes. So, I've been, like, I get on the thing and I, I ramble for like seven minutes, and then I'm like, okay, bye bye. You know what I'm saying? So, like, if this was your first video for You Not Only Random, like, you, you just gonna realize I ramble. And, like, I don't come up here set, set with no idea about what I'm gonna say. I just open my mouth. And then whatever comes out, whatever comes out, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, it just be what it be. And maybe if you heard something that you needed to hear, let me know down below. You know? It's one of those situations. Sometimes you say things without even realizing that you're saying things and you're just speaking. You're just speaking on some things. And then you like, wow. Wow, I have these thoughts in my head. Sometimes you speak and you don't hear yourself speaking. So, like, it's just, I just find this very interesting. Social media, I really want to continue to do this, you know. Um, to be completely honest, I am going to be a famous YouTuber, social media star, and I'm going to do it by just being myself. Um, so, if you're here from the beginning, I want to say thank you. That baby's still crying. But anyway, much love and positive vibes. I will see you next time. Oh. It's not a booger. It's my uh, septum nose piercing, okay?